Hello, hello, William. Good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. How are you, my friend? How's everything? I feel great, teacher. Excellent, excellent. That's the attitude, my friend. It's raining hard here in my oh, Really? Yes. Oh, yeah. One, uh, like, one hour ago, it was raining pretty hard here. Yeah. And it was the... terrible. Yeah, it's the... In my world, day was light today, teacher. Light means a kilo. Yes, yes. Really? Yes, back, back. Uh, me siento, I feel. I feel, yes. Uh, back, I, I feel sad, teacher. Tell me why. Uh, Le dispararon, ¿cómo diría? Shoot. Who got shoot? Shoot. Tell me the sentence. Eh, le dispararon a un muchacho y lo mataron. Ooh. Today in the world is called. A guy got shoot. A guy got shot. Uh, oh, that's terrible. So sorry to hear that. Killer, 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 teacher. That's bad. That's so bad. Yeah, este. Ay, está triste la familia. ¿Cómo diga? Yeah, the family is sad. The family, the family is sad. Yeah, I can imagine. I can imagine. Yeah, it's no, difficult. No, no, no uh, is every day is the, uh, uh, digamos, almost uh, lower this column. Yeah, you know, the situation, the social situation here in our country is complicated. Complicated. But we need to. We need all, to all, be strong. All, all country, all country is the, uh, está pasando, how do you it's, say? It's, it's going it's, through. It's going to for one is the situation negative for, for the yeah. delinquents, for the delinquents. Yeah, because of the delinquency. To 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 Robin and Jumbert. Yeah. To to Jung. Uh, I yesterday uh, lost lost in yeah. lost in in Nuevo Jucatlán. Uh, son de la Urdes. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, the one who got lost. Yes, I yes. know, I know. Yes. Yeah, well, so sorry to hear that. Welcome to the class, William. We are going to be talking today about different topics. Welcome. Yeah, thanks. Let's see, Susana, hello, how are you? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Hi, fun. Thanks, teacher. How was your day? Uh, today, uh, working. I, uh, I, uh, I, I worked. Mm -hmm. I worked. Yes. Uh, every day. <laughs> yeah, well, you know. That's normal. That's the way it goes. It's a, it's a, a routine every day. <laughs> it's a routine. Yeah, you know, 
Yeah, that's the daily routine, but I, what I else have... can we do? ¿Qué más le podemos hacer? Yes, teacher. <laughs> we need to I, I, make I the effort. Poor. <laughs> I am poor. Yeah, we I, are, we are. We are. Yes, but uh, it's a, uh, yeah, what's the major? The mayor um, yesterday um, um, has yesterday uh, has I has uh, uh, every uh, they they has they happy no un día feliz it was a happy day. Uh -huh. Yesterday was a happy day. Yesterday? Was a happy day. Ah, uh, it's a happy day. I, I, I stayed, stayed uh, with yes. my family. Mm -hmm. You stay with your family? Yes. Okay, that's nice, that's nice. Just give me a second. Okay, and today was, tell me, did it rain pretty hard for your home? Llovió mucho por ahí? Yes, teacher. Yes. Uh, is the energy? Yeah. I don't. I I don't have energy. Electric really? energy. Yes. There's no electricity. Yes. Yeah. Um, has it has the one 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 hour. Oh. Mm -hmm. You ain't got electricity since since Same. one hour ago. Okay. Since one hour ago. Well, welcome to the class, Susana. Nice having you here today. Okay. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Who? Daniel. Hello, Daniel. How are you? Hi, teacher. How are you, mister? I'm fine, and you? I'm here, you know. Just great, same old story. Oh, that's great. I, I, I believe I hear my name, right? Yes, yes, I was talking oh, to you, yes. Okay, okay. <laughs> no problem, no problem. So, how was your weekend? You told me you were going to rest this weekend. Um, uh, at the end, no, <laughs> because uh, on Sunday, well, I told you that I will go to Morazan. That I was going so to go. I was going to Morazan. So uh, that was, I came back here at 4 p.m. Um, well, the night was really calm, relaxed, and on Sunday, um, well, Sunday was a uh, rest day, yes. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. You know, resting is very important. Yes. And so tell me, how was the, how was the trip to Morazan? Are they still working on the street, on the road? No, well, they are finished some uh, little sectors. sectors yeah but the main well the major part it's already done okay not the major you can say most of it oh, okay most of it it's already done 
Okay. Most, Most of, of it, it is already done. Or it's already done. Already right done. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me structure this sentence. Most of it is done already. I'm sorry. Oh. Okay. Most of it is done already. Most of it is done already. Yeah, I'm so sorry. I was thinking in Spanish. I don't know why. In English, they already goes at the end. Okay. Oh, in this okay. Oh, that's good. So how long did it take you to get from Morazan to San Salvador? Uh, about two and a half hour. Oh, that's fine. It's acceptable. Yeah. Not that much traffic. No, no, it was really calm because from yeah. San Salvador we uh, left left at 5.30 a.m. Okay. So there, there were no traffic. Yeah, that's good. And I was thinking about mm -hmm. that, that if you came to San Salvador at 4 p.m., I mean, you left Morazan like two, one and a half. Yeah, yeah, yeah. something. And at that time, there's not that much traffic. Yeah, we believe, no. We think in that too because we driving thought, with traffic, we it's, thought, uh, we thought of that too because it's uh, for me it's better. It's relaxing driving without traffic. Yeah, of course it is. <laughs> we thought about it too. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, because I mean, I like I like driving long distances, but like that, when it's like no traffic, because man, to be stuck in traffic is terrible, terrible. Like tonight, people who has been on the road, man, with this storm. Yeah, the storm. Well, I was at the supermarket, and there only were about. 20 minutes and the streets was really um, inundados, flood. Flood. flood, yes, flood. Yeah. Inundados, yeah, I imagine, man, it's, it's rain. You know, in my house, uh, there's no, usually there's no leaks. Oh, and, okay. and now today with this storm, man, I was like, checking out, checking out, and I found one, big one. And I oh. was like, uh, I had to, I may do just for today. I fix it up just for today because I put, uh, uh, how do you call, silicon. Oh, okay. to, but I mean, it's not like, like completely sealed. Uh, tomorrow, if I got the time, I'm going to fix it up. Okay. And yeah, there, that's and important. Uh, it's it's nice when you can fix one 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 thing. Well, one problem by one, one yeah. by one, and you don't accumulate too much, too much, too work. much. Yeah, of course. Yeah. And I got another wall that I will uh, impermeabilize. Yeah. Because I have to. I found out that there's a, there's a little bit. Of, we got a problems with the I don't know the word in English. Sepos. Ah yeah yeah. So I gotta work on it, man. And I hate I hate doing sepos. I don't like. Yeah, it it's that. really really hard. When I was yeah. making the social hours at the. Yeah university uh, we take we took well we went to a construction to help like auxiliar como se dice? yes the auxiliary <laughs> yeah and the foreman uh, is not teach us is with which is the Past. Which was? No, which is the which is the the, the, the steps? 
Which are well, the steps? They teach us that how to make it, but he he make it look well. He he made, he it, made, look, it, made it look he made it look really easy. easy. Yeah, but when we try, it was really really hard. It is it is hard. Man, it's terrible. I never like to do that. I never like it. And I will have to, uh, I hate that. But yeah. now I will go the easy way. Now you can, you can in your meal and say it with, uh, I mean, with foam or with uh, 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 yeah, that's products exactly like paint. What we are gonna do in the remote, the Remodel yeah. remodelation. Remodelation, yeah. Remodelation. Remodeling, no, are, rem remodeling. Remodeling, we are making. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I mean, there's they sell the paint now to just to cover and forget about it. Yeah. I mean, if there's an easy way to do it, let's do it like that because man, it's terrible. Well, Daniel, always a pleasure talking to you. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Wilfredo, where are you? I saw you a few minutes ago. See, hey, Wilfredo, you around? Oh, perhaps he's busy. Let's see, let's see who else is around. Hey, Fernando, how are you? Hi, teacher. I'm swimming here. <laughs> oh man, don't tell me about it. That's what I was talking to Daniel. I found a leak on my roof, man. I was almost swimming. And the problem was that it was in the middle of the living room. Man, terrible. <laughs> so, yeah, it's raining a lot here. And the, and the connection is... Unstable. Mm, unstable, right. Okay. We will talk later, Fernando. So perhaps your connection stabilizes as soon as the rain finishes, because we got a lot of activity. So right now, try to concentrate in listening. I know that it's hard with the rain, but let's try to stay in touch, okay? Okay, teacher, thank you. No, thanks to you. Let's see, let's see. Claudia, hello, Claudia. Oops, I don't hear you. Okay, Claudia, we will talk later. Perhaps you're having problems. Let's see, who else do I have around? This storm is giving problems to everyone. Maria Alejandra, hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. <laughs> Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. And you? I'm just fine. Just fine. Happy to be here with you guys. So tell me, how was your weekend? What did you do? Um, the, on Saturday, I... On have, Saturday? On Saturday, I, have, I had a day long. A long day. A long day, I'm sorry, a long day. I still working at 6 p.m. maybe. Um, I was, I was still working. I was still working at 6 p.m. I had a lot of work. Um, and then I have a dinner with my friend uh, for the Garcia. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> yes, I spent time with my friend Melissa and Colocho. <laughs> what, um, which year did you graduate? ¿En qué año se graduó? My 2009. 2009. 2009. Oh my gosh, I know some of your classmates. <laughs> I went to your graduation. 
Yes, I don't know. I don't remember. Yes, I went. I um uh, I have a uh, un grupo pequeño sería a small group. A small group that at friend because I is starting the Garcia only for the high school. High school. Uh huh. Yeah, but I remember I went to to your graduation. I was there. <laughs> um, fuimos la última. We were the last. We were the last graduation in the. Um, I don't remember, but it a hotel or the Sheraton. I don't know. At that time was the president, right? Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. I... Yes, I went to your party, your graduation <laughs> party. <laughs> um, I don't remember. Oh yeah, I was there. Good memories, <laughs> nice. Um, so you had dinner with your friends, that's nice. Yes, because... Where did you go? Uh, sushi King. I went to the oh. sushi king and I and ate and a sushi because yes. Melissa her her birthday of Melissa Melissa's Friday. birthday Melissa's birthday was on Friday was on Friday but it's more complicated in the week during uh, the week uh -huh. and only that. And the Sunday, I went to my mother's house and I went to my grandma. And in the night, I bought pupusas in Trifinio Pupuseria. <laughs> <laughs> and only that. Um, I don't, I don't, or oh, I didn't have a lot of pendientes or cosas así. Okay, well, that's nice to hear. Thank you very much, Maria Alejandra. <laughs> You're welcome, teacher. Okay, let's see, Wilfredo, now I got you. How are you, my friend? Hi, teacher. How's everything? How's everything, Wilfredo? I'm fine, teacher, but I I I can hear you well because it is raining it's very raining. hard. Yeah. Okay. It is it is cold because I can hear you well, teacher. No problem. We will talk Sorry, later, okay? Yes. We can call uh, another another moment. Yeah. Don't worry. Don't worry. That's okay. That's Thanks. okay. That's the problem that everybody's having right now. Let's see, I'm Mr. Okay, Osorio. Because... Thank you very much, Wilfredo, and welcome. Mr. Osorio, what about you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Is it raining by your house? Yes, a little, teacher. A little bit. Man, it was a heavy a storm bit. here. Yes. But anyway, what can we do? So tell me, how was your day, Mister? Uh, it's always uh, it's a uh, a little busy day, teacher, with some activities that I I provide in 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 a regular day. And what about yesterday? Did you rest? Did you have fun with your family? Yeah, you told me you were going to spend time with your family, right? Uh, yes, teacher, but I didn't. I didn't uh, spend time because on Saturdays I worked uh, for six hours. For six hours in the in in the afternoon when I return. I decided to rest and sleep for a while because I feel, felt a little bad teacher. Really? And, 
Yes, and I decided to take some pills for to feel better. And they put you yeah. to sleep. Yes, teacher. Then on Sunday, I felt a little worse again. And, oh my gosh. But and what I about took, now? And I How took more pills. And again to sleep. Uh -huh. yes. And spent the day with a little fever. Oh and my I, gosh. I could not to do what I have planned, teacher. Yeah, so sorry to hear that, my friend. Are you feeling any better? Uh, no, I feel better, teacher. That's good, that's good. Perhaps you uh -huh, need to rest. Necesitaba descansar. That's yes, very teacher. important. Resting yes, teacher, you're very, right. Very important. I mean, mm -hmm. sometimes your body demands to rest. Yes, teacher. Excellent. Well, nice to have you here in class, my friend. Welcome. Thank, thank you, teacher. Walter. Hello, Walter. Hello, teacher. How are you? Uh, everything fine. Did you have a good day today? Yes. And good day. And interesting hey. day. Oh, really? An interesting day. That's cool. That's nice uh -huh. attitude for a day. And tell me, what about yesterday? What did you do? Did you have fun? Did you relax at home? Did you go play soccer? Ah, yes, teacher. Uh, um, and yesterday, uh, uh, we went uh, playing soccer. Uh, how do you say, lastimosamente perdimos? Oh, regretfully. Oh, perdimos. Regretfully, uh, hold on, regretfully, we lost. Okay. Regretfully, we lost. Regretfully, we lost. We lost. Yes, teacher. Wow. That happens. That happens. I mean, no, 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 problem, no, problem. no problem. Yes. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> uh, you don't win them all. No se ganan todos. Yes, yes. Uh, let me tell you, teacher. Bienvenido yeah. al club, Walter. <laughs> oh, oh my friend also my lost friend, the game. My friend. My friends. Yeah, yeah. I can hear you now, teacher. But excellent, Walter, excellent. Uh, Saturday, I'm sorry, in the afternoon, we lost the match. Uh, it was very, very well. <laughs> how many, oh how many goals? What was the score, Wilfredo? It, it, it was like basketball because we lost, yeah, eight. How many? To eight to one. Ooh. We didn't complete that, the thing. Uh, what we about you, complete. Walter? <laughs> what was your score? Um, uh, two? Don't cry. Uh, two zero uh, or one. two one? Two one. Yes, two one. Oh. Two to one, oh. it's okay. Two to one. Man, eight. Yes. Oh. Eight, that was yes, big, sure. Wilfredo. That was terrible. Yes. <laughs> yes. But the important, it is. Oh, my friend, I'm sorry for you. It is to play, teacher. The result, yeah, of course. Yes. But, but it is, it is hard. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, but the attitude is that the important thing is to, to have fun to play, to yeah. enjoy the moment. Yeah, yes. Uh, yeah, I mean, yes. Uh, let me tell you, um, on Saturday. On uh, Saturday? On Saturday, uh, we went to visit the park of Balboa. Oh, Balboa's Park. Yeah, Balboa's Park is beautiful. Oh, yeah, it's uh, nice. I guess uh, there, there are the, the kinds of the football, basket. Okay, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There are soccer fields. Soccer fields. And basketball courts. In English, 
it's different. When it's soccer, it's soccer field. When it's basketball, okay, it's basketball court. English is different. Oh. El campo de, de soccer es field. Okay, teacher. Basketball court. Pero de basketball es It's beautiful. Court. It's beautiful. Yes, it is. I'm having problems with your connection, Walter. We will talk later because you get like cut. So oh, corta oh. ahorita. Okay, thank, thank you, you Walter. It's and beautiful. Welcome to the class. Beautiful depot. Yeah, it is. It's a beautiful place. Thank oh, you very much, okay. Walter. So, you, no you problem. No problem. No problem. Yeah, connection is bad tonight. Let's see. Let's see who else is around. I still got some time. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Fabiola, hello. How are you? Hello, teacher. Hello, Fabiola. How's I'm everything? I'm fine. <laughs> okay. Tell me, what time did you get home today? Did you get, did you get wet? Se mojó? No. Uh, okay, you got home before the storm. Yes, teacher. Oh, that's fine. Did it rain around your house? I rained very strong. Where the teacher? Strong. Strong. Yes. Okay. And tell me, how was your weekend? Um, Saturday, um, clean my house. And the rest, all day. Oh, resting all day. That's cool. cool. <laughs> That's cool. Yes, and yesterday. Uh, and went, yesterday. And yesterday I went to drink coffee with my friend. <clears throat> oh, that's cool. Okay, <laughs> hold on. You can say it like this. Mm -hmm. You can say it like this. I went for a cup of coffee with my friends. Like this. I went for a cup of coffee with my friends. Okay. I went for a cup of coffee with my friends. Oh, well, that's good. That's good. I mean, it's excellent that you had the opportunity to, to have fun and relax. Thank you very much and welcome to the class. Okay. okay, guys, I'm so sorry that I have forgotten. Let me please get the today's attendance. Okay, let's see, today is Monday the 20th. Let's see, Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Thank you. Carlos Antonio Murillo Hernandez. Present teacher. Thank you. Claudia Lisset Ramos Barrientos. Thank you, Claudia. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. Thank you. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Mr. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. María Luisa Morales de Portillo. Uh, Marta Navelinda Morales. No, Marta Navelinda Morales de Portillo. I'm sorry. Present teacher. Thank you. I was putting your last names to María Luisa. María Luisa is Morales de Corpeño. And let's see, Néstor Omar López Castro. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. It's connected. Roxana Ibeta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Thank you, Walter. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. Thank you. 
William Shevani Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Shanira Elizabeth Asensio Garcia. Present teacher. Thank you. Marcela Margarita Fuentes Nuela. Jensi Elizabeth Miranda de Odanes. Present teacher. Fabiola Georgina Silva. Present. Thank you. Okay, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's continue, guys. Well, I was talking today, I have time for this, for the speaking section. I have, uh, I modify my lesson plan so we could have more time for conversation, okay? So let's see, Ambar, hello, Ambar, how are you? Hello, teacher, I'm fine. What about you? Come on, Ambar, you tell me like, I'm fine. I didn't hear you, fine. I'm great. I'm great. Thank you. Tell me, how was your day, Amber? Um, I I have a I had a relaxed day because I don't have I didn't have sorry a lot of calls. But okay. I hope to tomorrow. I hope tomorrow. How do you say? I hope to tomorrow improve my sales. Okay, yeah, I imagine, I imagine. Let's hope, I mean, I, I imagine that that happens sometimes, that one day is slow and next day you like have to work a lot. Yes, some days is really relaxing, some days is really hard, but uh, how do you say the fructiferous? Um, oh man, productive, wow, you, days. productive, productive days, productive productive. Days. Yes, yes, that's the expression. Yeah, well, the good thing is that you got the attitude, and that's very important to have the proper attitude to be like focused on, on working, and that yes. tomorrow is going to be a better day. Yes, teacher. And tell me how I was wondering. Listen up, guys. I'm sorry, you can bark. Uh, let's see, let's see. Hold on. I was wondering. This is another way to say, eh, me preguntaba. I was wondering, how's your pet? Um, she She's good. Uh, the Saturday, I went for her to pet hospital. And now I I have to put the medicine in her body. Okay. Well, let's hope the medicine works properly and, and her fine. scar. The uh, her scar is scar is like is cicatrice. Cicatrice. Right? Yes. Yes. Well, let's hope everything goes okay. I went to pick her up to the hospital, okay? Amber? Okay, teacher. I La went fui to? A recoger, right? Okay. I went to pick her up. I went to pick her up. Well, let's hope the little thingy comes out okay. Esperemos que le vaya bien. Thank you, teacher. No, no, it's very important to take care of the pets. That's very nice. So you've been like, uh, you, you've been pampering your pet. Yes. Well, let's see. 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 let Right, but pampered someone is consentir. Chinchinear de cima Okay. Uh -huh. That's why we say pampering. You were pampering. Hey, nice talking to you, Ambar. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Let's see. Um, mm -hmm. Roxana. Hello, Roxana. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Are you swimming in your house? 
also. <laughs> yeah, because some areas of yeah. around where you live are terrible. Yeah, uh, I read in Facebook in a, in a few minutes that the um, Triangulo de Santa Lucia, I don't know, there is a, yeah, there is a, a bus in the water because there is a, like a lago, lake. Oh, really? Yeah, it's, and, yeah, it's too close to my house. And the bus got stuck. Yes, it's in the middle. Okay, okay, you say it like this, the bus is stuck. The, es, the está atrapado, stuck is atrapado. Se quedó trabado. Trabado, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, it's atrapado. That, I mean, but in Salvadorian we say it like, yeah, it's stuck. Oh, that's so bad. Yes, it's very difficult in this uh, uh, sound, sound, sound? Neighborhood because area. Neighborhood, yeah, because in my house, for example, uh, in I live in the principal street, but uh, on the main also, street on the, in main, the main street. Yeah, in the main street. But um, sometimes when the when there is a, a raining, it, we have a um, creciente. How do you say creciente? Oh, really? Yeah, but um, mm, my house, my house is like um, in the, como embajada, no sé. It's, it's... Okay, there's a flu, flu is una creciente, you know. And, uh -huh. and my house is in a lower part, es en una parte baja. Mm, not really. Or it's, it's, it's going it... down. Then it's yeah, going it's going down. eso. My house is going down. So, ¿así sería? Está no. como... Hold on. It will be, my house is going down the street. Mm -hmm. My house is going down the street, to a street. The street, going the down street. the street. But uh, Santa Lucia, um, there is in the um, hole, maybe, como en una, un pequeño hoyo. So, yeah. uh, so the water is is all the time um, estancada in, in in this place. So everybody in this in this uh, neighborhood uh, need to uh, go out to their uh, houses because the water is into them. Oh really? Yeah. In my house, not, but this. This uh, place is close, is too close to my house, maybe in one kilometer, I guess. One yes, kilometer. I don't know. Stank, it's stagnant. ¿Cómo sería? Stagnant. 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 So it's very difficult. Now it's not raining here, but uh, in a few minutes, it's very A strong. few minutes ago. A, a few, few minutes, minutes ago. A few minutes ago, the raining, it was very stronger. Okay, let me clarify something for you. A few minutes ago, it means... A few uh, minutes? Hold on. It means hace unos minutos. If you say mm -hmm, mm -hmm. in a few minutes, you are talking about the future. Mm, okay. Okay. Let's say thank you. En unos minutos o en unos instantes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. okay. In this case, it was a few minutes ago. Yes. Because it was now it's not ago. raining. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's not raining no more. It's not raining no more. I hope so. <laughs> yeah, well, let's hope everything goes okay. Thank you very much, Roxana, and welcome. You're welcome. Francisco, hello, Francisco. Long time not talking to you. How are you? Hey, 
fine, teacher. You working? No, teacher. Uh, I, uh, I went to work uh, in the morning. Oh, that's cool. And tomorrow? Uh, morning too, teacher. Oh, you got the morning shift also? Man. <laughs> so tomorrow you got to wake up very early. Yes, teacher. 4 a.m. Okay. Around yes. 4 uh, or 4 30 a.m. Around 4 or 4 30. That means that today you woke up at 4 a.m. Yes, teacher. Yes. Ooh. Today is, uh, was uh, a busy day in the work. Oh, really? At work. Today was a busy day at work. Yes, teacher. At work. Because uh, uh, I uh, I has many activity maintenance activity teacher. Oh, I had. I had I had many maintenance activity. Okay. Well, but the good thing is that you are working, man. That's really important. And tell me, what about the weekend? How was yesterday for you? I, yesterday I, I I rest teacher because uh, the Saturday I I went all day. And you got uh, you got all day at work. Yes, the, uh, on Saturday. On Saturday so I, yesterday was yesterday was a sleeping time. Mm, so so teacher. <laughs> Not really, but resting. <laughs> yeah. Uh, how do you say eso hubiera sido lo ideal? <laughs> oh, well, that would have been the ideal. Okay, sure. <laughs> but uh, I, uh, I went, uh, I, when fuimos, yes, I went. Yes, we went. I, we went, uh, we went uh, to uh, my my parents, my parents' house. Oh. oh, that's nice. Yeah, you went to visit. Yeah, that's, I mean, it's fine. It feels good, but it's not resting, actually. <laughs> this, is the, this is the point. <laughs> yeah, it's not resting. Yes, they should. And the, the Saturday uh, was uh, on Saturday. Saturday, Saturday on Saturday in the uh, at work uh, was a terrible day. <laughs> so you haven't really, really, really rest actually. Yes, the church, yes. <laughs> uh, that happens. That happens. Look at it in this way, Francisco. So you can feel a little bit better. Let's see. Let me see. Saturday. What did I do Saturday? Work in the morning. And then uh, let's see what else. In the afternoon, one meeting. And then Sunday, I in the morning, I was working, fixing up some stuff at home and getting some uh, Fixing some stuff here, like working as a carpenter in the afternoon. I was hired to do some stuff, plumbing. I was working as a plumber. Let's do it. There. <laughs> and then at night, I got insomnia. I couldn't sleep last night. I went to sleep like around 3, 3 30 in the morning. Did you and, and I went to work at 6 today. Uh, uh, was a uh, a busy a busy weekend, teacher. Oh no, I'm sorry, I forgot. Also, yesterday, well, last night, I was helping a friend with some electrical stuff. Also, uh, teacher, what meaning is stuff? Cosas. Ah, oh, okay, the cosas. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's similar to say things. Yeah. Yeah. 
in the same it's, it's the same word. Yeah, but colloquially it's better to say stuff. I mean, I was helping I was helping him with some things. I what I was helping him with some stuff. Colloquially uh, it sounds better if you say stuff. Stuff. Is yeah, is the most suena mejor. Yeah. Uh, okay. Colloquially. Uh, it's a, it's a new word. <laughs> Yeah, it's stuff. Stuff can mean different things. Can mean, uh, uh, I mean, I have some stuff to do. Tengo cosas por hacer. Okay. I have to deal with some stuff. Tengo que mm, lidiar con ciertos asuntos. I have to deal with some stuff. Good. Let me text it for you. Oh, thank you, sir. Yeah, the word is uh, is a uh, most uh, is a more native uh, word. Yeah, yeah. Actually, it is. Okay. <laughs> well, thank you very much. Nice talking to you, Francisco. Thank you, Chair. Carlos, hello. How is it going, Carlos? Hello, teacher. How's everything? Um, I'm um, very busy, but uh, uh, it's fine. I feel it's good. Okay, now you're in San Salvador or over there? No, I'm in Bolivia, teacher. Okay, how's the weather? Today must be cold. <laughs> no, uh, now it's very cold, but it's not very cold. It's a, actually, is it's it raining. Is it raining right now? Yes, it's a, but if you don't hear, was because I I was staying in in the what do you say? Planta baja, it's a, on the first floor. Okay, I, I stay on the first floor and on the second floor, it's, it's really, really hard, the rain. Oh, yeah, I imagine, I <laughs> imagine. Really yes. Well, but it's good to have you here and it's excellent. I congratulate you that you are making the effort to stay here. Thank you very much, Carlos. Thank you. Thank you, Peter. Oh, my gosh, Janira is back. Hello, yes. Janira. <laughs> you can see Carlos, she's back. Hello, Welcome. teacher. You're the new student in the in the class. Hello, how are you? I'm really good, teacher. Yeah, you know, even Wilfredo look at you and says like, who's that? <laughs> yes, I come back, teacher. I came back. My headache. I came back. Yeah. <laughs> you are my headache. Okay, tell me, tell me, Shanira, how was it for you today? Well, it was a normal day, teacher. Okay, and what about yesterday? What did you do yesterday? Tell me, did you finally rest? Uh, no, teacher, not really. Uh, my weekend was very busy. On Sunday, on Saturday, I, I told you I... Need to solve. I needed to. I, I needed to. I needed to solve a lot of stuff. I went to the tree bank and I, yes, I spent all my uh, Saturday uh, on, mon on Monday, on Monday, or in Monday. Hmm? Saturday, Monday. Mon Saturday, Monday is today. No, eh, la mañana del sábado. Saturday morning. Oh, Saturday morning. Yeah, Saturday morning. And on Sunday at afternoon, I in the went, afternoon. In the afternoon, I went to shopping with my friend. I went shopping. Yeah, I went shopping. Oh and my gosh, I, you went shopping? You don't like going shopping. <laughs> and I walk a lot, 
searching for uh, sandals, sandalias. Yeah. Yeah, for sandals. Was very tired, but I hear I work. I made. Uh, how do you say tarea de casa? You say, but I forgot. Home. House shirts. House shirt. I repaired uh, my desk because I don't know how do you say las patas. The, the 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 legs actually those are the legs. Okay, the legs needed some fixing. Paint. Uh, okay. Not really fixing paint and I reorganize some tables and that's it. Oh my gosh, that means that you are you are pretty handy at home. What does mean handy, teacher? Uh, that uh, you do different stuff, not just ah. the, the little chores. I mean, you see something, oh, there's paint, you go and paint. There's something else to fix, you try to fix it. Yes, because my mom is the same. Then, <laughs> uh, so how do you say RD? Oh, you say it like this. I take after my mom. I'm sorry, my I take, I take after my mom. I take after my mom. This then I fix a lot of stuff in my house. And let me see what more I would cut very early today because I walk with my my dogs. I wake up at 5.30 five and I walk for one, one and a half hour. One, one hour and a half? Yes, one hour and a half. That's and crazy. <laughs> and that's it, teacher. Okay, well, quite interesting. Thank you very much, Janita, and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Let's see, I still got five minutes, so let me make it fast. Hello, Nicolas, how are you? Hello, teacher. Hello, everybody. Good afternoon. Good evening. Ah, oh, sorry, good evening. Come on, Nicolas, what happened? Good afternoon. Is it is the moment? Is the moment? Okay. I well, uh, in my house, in my work is very good. Is they and oh really? Yes. You, uh, you had a good day. Yeah. Yes, is a good, is a good day. Is a very working, was okay. very working, and I finished a report on the the water law of our country. Oh, interesting. So you've been it, quite busy. Quite busy. So, okay. How let do me, you say let me fun? let me text it to you. You been uh, quite busy. You been quite busy. You been very busy. Very much. That's more than very much. Es más que very much. Okay. Okay. You okay. been quite busy. Ocupadísimo. Quite busy. With some. Okay. That would be ocupadísimo. Uh, you have been quite busy. Yep. Okay. You have. Yes, I been I've quite been. busy. Okay, cool. Perfect. Okay, yeah. and 
Um, for example, it, well, it, it is, this is now. Uh, my, um, yesterday, we had a lunch in La Libertad with my wife. Oh, and that's cool. Yes, and two of my children. We celebrate the eve, the eve of his birthday. Birthday. Okay, that's nice. Just remember something. Thank you very much, Nicholas. Just okay, remember thank something. You. Just remember something. Children is plural. You don't say children's. Children is plural. Child is singular. Okay. Uh, sounds okay. In and two of my uh, two of my children. To my to my children. Two of my children. Two all my children. Perfect. Thank you very thank much. Thank you, teacher. No, thank, thank you, you, teacher. Two of my children. Let's see. Okay. Let's see who I still got a little bit of time. Two of my children. Jose, I saw you a few minutes ago. Two of my children. Are you children. available now? Mr. Osorio? Not again. Okay, let's see, let's see, who else? Mm -hmm. Sylvia, hello, Sylvia. Hello, teacher. How are you? I am good, thank you. What about you? I'm just fine, just fine. Tell me, how is it going? Everything good, teacher. Okay, and what's new? Um, it's raining, so oh, really? it was raining when I, when I had to leave work. Ooh, you got yeah. wet. No, really, because I got an um, umbrella right. with me. Oh. Yes. Oh, you got an umbrella. <laughs> yeah. You know, carrying an umbrella actually is a pretty formal way of get wet. Of getting wet. Yes, because, because when I mean, it's you windy. you look very formal. You look very formal, but you get wet with an umbrella. When it's raining <laughs> hard, you always get wet. It doesn't matter that I mean, you just cover a little part of your body, and the rest gets wet. <laughs> yes, my shoes are completely wet. Soak through. Suck through, empapados. Um, suck through. Yeah. Yeah, suck that through. happens. That happens. That happens. Being there, don't that. But the good thing is that you're home already. So what time did you finish working today? At eight, but I left. I left almost at 8.30 Ooh. because it was raining hard. Because of the rain. Yeah, because of the rain. Okay, and how long did it take you? I mean, how long did it take you getting home? Today, about 20 minutes. Okay, you know, you can say it this, you can say it like this. You can say it like this. This is a new expression for you. You can say it, I made it in 20 minutes. Mm. I made it in 20 minutes. Yeah, you can say I made it or you can say I made it home in 20 minutes. But in okay. this case, because I was asking you already about getting home, you just say, oh, I made it in 20 minutes. Okay. Okay, Thank well, you. yeah, usually it takes you like 15 minutes, right? Yeah, 15 minutes. But now because of the rain, you made it like, it took you longer. Yes. It took me longer to get home today because of the rain. Okay, remember, if you notice, we are talking like kind of informal, okay? So you don't need to say because of, you just say cause of the rain. Mm -hmm. Okay, cause of the okay. rain. That's fine. And what about yesterday? 
was a lot of work to do? Mm, yeah, I I did the uh, the afternoon shift, so I started at one and I finished at eight. Today you again, got opening today. at night. Oh mm -hmm. no, you got night. Oh my gosh. It's hard, right? But at least when you got the night shift, you got a, uh, I mean, you got uh, sleep late. Yes, uh, I sleep until 8 or 9 p.m. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> yeah. That's nice. That's nice. Well, thank you very much and welcome to the class, Sylvia. Okay. You're welcome. Thank you. Let's see. Uh, I know I'm missing someone. Marta. Hello, Martha. Hi, teacher. Good evening. How's everything? Everything. Uh, it's okay. And you? Just fine. Just fine. You know, a little bit. No, actually, I'm not a little bit sleepy. I'm a little bit stressed, but mostly. What happened? Of, uh, well, uh, lack of sleep. Oh my God. Lack of sleep. I couldn't sleep properly last night. I went to sleep around 3 or 3.30 a.m. Oh my God. I'm so but sorry. Do you it's know not, drink not uh, I, tea? For, for no, sleep? I just. No, it doesn't work like that for me. Try, try. Yeah. And you know, it's not that I'm stressed. It's just that I feel a little bit tense on my on my on my shoulders. That's and all. Because everything else, I mean, one, cool. one tea, the, one tea of pillow is is good mm, for sleep. No, for sleeping, I'll yes. try it. I'll try it. I'll try pillow. to make one. Do you remember? <laughs> yeah, I will. I will. It just remind me of a book I read, no, a story I read. Yeah, Tilo and me. That was the name of a little dog. It's a story about a little dog that I read when I was a kid. I just remember that. Gosh. Well, thank you for the good memory you brought. You brought back to my mind. Thank you, Martha. <laughs> Thank you, welcome teacher. to the class. You're welcome. Okay, let's see, guys. Well, today, thank you very much to all of you for having participated and for being patient listening to the rest of the class. I know that for the ones who started the class, like William, he was the very first. Uh, it feels like long, but it's very important when we get to listen and when we listen to to other people's conversation because we get different accents and also if you notice we are getting different vocabulary. If you check out the chat section, man, we have a lot of vocabulary today. We have a lot of vocabulary, a lot of words and expressions that, I mean, they come useful and with practice, you will be getting them. That's why some of those expressions, I mean, I have like explaining it more than once, but perhaps the first time you don't quite get it. It's not in your mind. I mean, and it's not that you are going to learn them by heart. Learn by heart. Aprenderse de memoria. Learn by heart. Okay. It is not that you are going to learn by heart everything on the first time. It's a language and it's a matter of repetition and repetition and repetition. And also don't worry and please don't get mad if I am like correcting you for the same stuff. It's normal, that happens. Remember you are learning. So let's see, today we are going to go back to the manual. We have a little bit to cover with the manual but before going to the manual, let's see. Mm -hmm. Today I got, Maria Luisa Snow here. And I got uh, Mr. Osorio. Are you ready with your presentation? Uh, yes, teacher. Can you do it now? Yes. I'll try, teacher. Perfect. <laughs> 
<clears throat> Excuse me, give me a second to turn on my camera. No problem, no problem. Uh, uh, good evening, everybody. Good evening, teacher. The, in this time, I will talk about my job position and some knowledge that I must have to perform efficiently in the industrial engineering department. And I apologize because I have not a presentation to show you. No problem, no problem. Mm -hmm. I have worked as a sewing coach or sewing training since 2006 and the position is focused on increasing productivity in production cells, for which uh, is necessary to certify in statistical process control and SP, SPC to analyze the variations that directly or indirectly affect the the output of the production flow. In addition, the certification or quality control to generate a criteria that allows timely decision to be made or, or to take a decision. Then the MTM certification as a method time measurement uh, which uh, is an international system for measuring methods times. Um, and that, that system assigns uh, some values uh, less than one second to each type of, of movement. In addition, uh, there is there is a certification in the analytical training method. Analytical training methods, uh, which is used to train or, or retrain new personnel or personnel who will have, have conversion into the production they make. Then, Everything is complemented uh, with knowledge of sewing equipment and sewing operation uh, about learning to, to sew in the, in the equipment. Uh, and all above helps the, the sewing trainer to have a solid technical knowledge. And my position is now, it's known a SWAT sewing trainer because I can work in the area of personnel recruitment, training of, of, of sewing methods, production units with around 90, 90 persons, conversion and distribution on the production floor, improve the restrictive operation, uh, projects of quality control, uh, innovation projects, and in approvals related to packaging processes, and among other activities, it is related uh, to my career and greatly complements the knowledge necessary to give me solid experience in the garment manufacturing industry. But now I would like to acquire some knowledge uh, in the area of logistic and supply chain, uh, chains and, and exports. Mm, only that teacher. Wow, that's a lot, that's a lot. Okay, we are going to, to review a little bit of the pronunciation. 
Let's see. So we're training certify, 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 certify. Criteria, criteria. Non criteria, criteria. Criteria. Okay. This expression was okay. Timely decisions. It's just to, to clarify to your classmates. When we say timely decisions, um, decisiones oportunas related to the time. Okay. And let's see. Measurements. Measurements. Say with me, please, Jose. Measurements. 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 Measuring. 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 About mediciones. Yep. Measuring. Values. 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 And let's see. And it's remember. the same. Valores. Yeah, and remember, suing, 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 suing. Okay, there's there's no e in the pronunciation. No hay ninguna e in the pronunciation. It's suing, suing. Okay, teacher, get it. Perfect. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's see. Let's continue. Let's continue, guys. Now, please, if you got your manual handy, we are going to work in the manual, guys. Okay, let me see. Okay, guys, we are, going, we are working in the manual in page number 33, exercise number four, okay? How do you organize training for your staff? Number the steps in the correct order. Okay, we have a lot to do tonight in this hour, but before we do this, I am so sorry, perdone. My bad, my bad. I forgot getting the attendance. Damn, that's no good. Let me get the attendance quite fast. Amber Eli Alfaro Gomez? Present. Carlos Antonio Murillo Hernandez? Present, teacher. Claudia Lizette Ramos Barrientos? Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia? Thank you, Claudia. Present. Fernando Marvin Gonzalez Martinez? Present. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa. Present teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Marta Anabelinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Néstor Omar López Castro. Nicolás Antonio. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granado. Sorry, Nicolás. Me, present, present. Thank you. Roxana Iveta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present, teacher. Uh, Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present, teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Janira Elizabeth Asensio Garcia. Present teacher. Marcela Margarita Fuentes Nuila. Jensi Elizabeth Miranda de Odanes. Present. Fabiola Georgina Silva. Present. Thank you. Okay, guys, let's see. I'm sorry, we go back to the, to the screen I was sharing with you. So sorry. Okay, we got we got in remember page number 33, exercise number four. It's a pair work. I'm going to share with you the image of the exercise so you can get it. And the question you got there is how do you organize training for your staff? 
you have to number the steps in the correct order, okay? So you're going to tell me which one goes first, which one goes second. You're going to have four minutes for doing the exercise. I just share it for the ones who don't have the, the manual handy. And you're going to work in groups of three members. I told you three minutes. That's enough just to number the activities, okay? Just let me get the groups ready. And let's see, just a little something. Perfect. Okay, groups are created. Please, let's jump in. Three minutes. Good. Hey, the teacher. Hello, guys. Hello. Okay. Uh, and your opinion? What is the number? One, two, two, papa. Correlative? One, one, two, two, papa. We are one, baby. Good night, baby. Okay. Uh, Carlos, what is the, the number? Yo. Acerta, um, probably is identified personal, current skills, and knowledge. Maybe identify personal, current skills, and knowledge. What do you think? Mm. Yes. Okay. Number one, identify personal current skills and knowledge. Okay. And number two, maybe is decide a skill and knowledge gaps on the green okay what you got for number one guys identify personal current skills and knowledge Ooh, do you want a little tip yes of course teacher number one analyze the job okay And, ah, number yes, two, of and number two, identify personal current skills and knowledge. Yes, because you need to know what is the job and then you identify who's need uh, get more knowledge. Yeah, and to do that, you need to identify first personal current skills and then you decide, oops, I'm gone. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Bye, bye. <laughs> more, more, more. <laughs> Maria Alejandra, I texted you. Okay. I'm gone. You are, I mean, I got carried on. Okay. That's, yeah, no problem. That's no Welcome to the class. Okay, guys, let's see. Oops. Do you want a tip? Yes, switch, switch number two and number five. Number two and number five. Switch. Change. Switch intercambio. Mm -hmm. Now, analyze. Now, analyze. Look, look, analyze the job. Identify personal current skills and knowledge, 
beside skills and knowledge gaps, identify, identify training solutions, implement training, evaluate performance after training. You see? That's yes. the order. Good That's idea. The order. Good job, teacher. Oh, you did good. You just had a little error. Okay, we are almost finished with the time. Claudia, still having problems with the microphone? Oh yeah, you don't have a microphone right now. Mm. What a change. Okay, 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 let's see, let's see, let's see. Let me see, everybody's here. Okay, now everybody's here. Okay, guys, let's see. What did I do? Oh, here. Okay, let's see. Now, let's see, Amber. Tell me, which is number one? Analyze the job. Perfect, Amber, you are Correct, my dear. Analyze the job, number one. Yeah. Okay, let's see, number two. Mm -hmm. Daniel, give me number two. Identify personnel's current skills and knowledge. Excellent. Let's see now, now, Jensi, give me number three. Besides skill and knowledge gap. Besides skills and knowledge gaps. Perfect. Fernando, number four, please. Oh, identify training solutions. Okay, identify, identify. Identify. Okay. Identify training solutions. Excellent. Number five goes to mm -hmm. Roxana. Number five is yours. Implement training. Okay. Implement training. Please, uh, William, help me out with number six. Read the sentence, please. Evaluate performance after training. Performance. Evaluate performance after training. Evaluate performance after training. Excellent. This is number six. Me costó elegir. Okay, okay. Yeah, it was hard for you. It was hard for you. I know, I know. Okay, guys, can I erase? Yes, teacher. Yes, Thank you teacher. very much. Excellent, thank you guys, appreciate it. Now let's see, next exercise. Again, we are going to do a match. We have to match these terms related to training and personal development to their meanings. 
and you're going to do it again in a small groups because it says here, check answers with a classmate. We've got goal, feedback, budget, knowledge gap, coaching, qualifications. A quality that makes someone suitable for a particular job, an estimation of income and expenses, helpful information or criticism about the performance of a person. Listen again, this one. Helpful information or criticism criticism about the performance of a person. The process of improving the performance of an employee. A desire result or possible outcome. And a regular balance of what a person should know. Okay, let's do it. Let me just get a picture again. We always do it like this. So everybody can have it like for sure. For this exercise, I'll give you five minutes because it's a little bit more complex, okay? And I will divide the, the groups again. Please, let's jump in. Five minutes, hurry up. the performance of an employee is improving is mejora goal is a uh, what met you want a goal goal is met. goal, goal. Oh, it's goal. A, a desired result or possible outcome i think That's my goal a desired result or possible, possible. outcome. Outcome. Yes, okay. that's a Thank goal. You, okay, the process. The process. No, it's a desired. A desired result. A desired result or possible yes. outcome. That's goal. Oh, okay. And number two. Two is feedback. Feedback, feedback is a uh, helpful information or criticism about criticism. 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 Uh, excuse me. Can you repeat? Repeat, please. Criticism. It's a little bit weird. Criticism. Yes. Criticisms. I... <laughs> Let me do it like this. It's difficult. Let me do it like this. I will send you the audio of the whole text, okay? Okay. So you can get it. Okay. Let me just mute myself for a second. Okay. And number three. Uh, book. Bootcamp. Number three. She's budget. Which is, is presupuesto. Which yes. is uh, an estim estima estimation of income an and expenses. Yes. That's okay. And number four. The knowledge gap. And an irregular balance of what a person should know. Y 
is is the same the 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 before exercise when, no, when and number four uh, aquarity the mic and song in particular joe excuse me can you repeat please uh, number number four four knowledge cup do you remember who is yeah. welcome to the group teacher let me see uh, uh perfect guys well done thank you thank you sure. <clears throat> Excuse me, six, three, two? Slowly, please. <laughs> six, three, two, five, one, four. Perfect. Five, one, one That's four. That's the correct order. Hey, thank you, teacher. Okay, I do it. I do it well. <laughs> Coach, coaching. Uh, okay, what's the order you got, guys? Uh, for the moment, <laughs> I, I think okay. okay. I, 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 I have six, three, two, five, one, four. Perfect, Carlos. Just perfect. That's okay. the correct order. Okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, tell uh -huh. me what's the what's your order? Which order do you get? Well, we think that the first one eh, eh, ¿cómo se lo digo, teacher? <laughs> the numbers. Goals. The numbers six, three, five, two, one, four. Okay, switch five and two, please. Three. Six, three, two. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Two. Esperado. How's it going, guys? Finish? Yeah, finish. Yes. Okay, tell uh, me your order, I... please. Ah, okay. Will you start, Silvia? Okay. You can um... tell me just the numbers. Just the numbers. Can you do it with the... The, the first one, teacher. Go. Or goals. Oh, goals. you can just tell me the numbers. Puede decirme solo los números. Okay. That's faster. Okay. Six. Yeah. Three. Perfect. Two. Three. Uh -huh. Five. One. Yeah. Four. Perfect. Excellent. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay, let's see, everybody's coming back. Just a few seconds. And now everybody's coming. Perfect. Let's see. Do I have them all? Oh, yeah, now I do.
Okay, let's do the exercise. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Number one, goal. Please, Daniel. What is goal? Uh, so, oh, goal. Yes. A uh, desired result or possible outcome. Okay. A desired result or possible outcome. Okay. Perfect. Number two, Silvia. Um, number two, feedback. Feedback yes. helpful information or criticism about the performance of a person. Okay, criticism, criticism. Criticism. Perfect. That's the okay. pronunciation, criticism. That's number two, excellent. Number three, Janira. Budget. An estimation of income and expense. Income and expenses. Perfect. Budget. Now, number four, Ambar. An irregular balance of what a person should know. Okay, that's knowledge gap. Knowledge gap. An irregular balance of what a person should know perfect amber thank you now let's see nicolas you got number five coaching coaching is the the process of improving the performance of an employee the process of improving the performance improving employee perfect walter you got number six Ah, that's easy. Uh, quality? Qualifications. Okay. Oh, yeah. I, yes, tell me. A quality? The mic and some more. And suitable. Suitable for a particular job. Yes, that's correct. A quality that makes someone suitable for a particular job. I will repeat. Goal, a desired Goal. result or possible outcome. Feedback, a helpful information or criticism about the performance of a person. Budget, an estimation of income and expenses. Knowledge gap. An irregular balance of what a person should know. Coaching, the process of improving the performance of an employee. Qualifications, a quality that makes someone suitable for a particular job. Okay, guys, next exercise. Now we have here, identifying training opportunities for personnel. Label the description of the process with the right heading. Okay, you have to put the name here. We got analyze the job, identify personnel's current skills and knowledge, identify training solutions, evaluate performance after training, decide skills and knowledge gaps. Let me read the text. List all opportunities and areas of improvement where training is necessary to increase effectiveness. Decide if there is a gap between the knowledge and skills of the staff. Ask employees what areas they need help with. Find the best way to improve, to provide training. One-on-one -on -one coaching, short-term and long-term trainings, e-learning. Decide the option that best fits the needs of your staff and company. Ask staff members to use a checklist and evaluate their progress. Look at the work area and check if there is still evidence of a deficiency in skills or knowledge. 
observe what the employee does well and what needs improvement. Check for qualifications, training courses, and responsibilities from previous positions. Get more individual information from human resources. Discuss and describe the responsibilities of the position with the employee. Write down indicators of knowledge and skill that match the position. Identify the processes changed in the description. Okay, guys, in this case, you will have exactly 10 minutes. It's a long exercise. You need to label, I can rotular that section, okay? So, the same groups, let's do it. Hurry up. Let's go check on the groups. Okay, okay ladies. Hello, teacher. Hello. Wow, Janita, such a motivation. My gosh. <laughs> oh, that's different. Because I use my, my laptop, teacher. And oh. it's uncomfortable. I prefer my, my desktop. Oh, really? Yeah. Because I have two monitors. And here, mm -hmm. only one. OK, you got, what is number one? The last? Is analyze the job. Yeah, the last one is analyze the job. That's right. I'll give you a tip. Number one and number two are identified. Yeah. Identify a training solution, number one. No. Because, no. because you better do at least. Number one, look at what it says. Number one says, list all opportunities in areas of improvement where training is necessary Number to increase four. effectiveness, decide if there is a gap between, here, decide if there is a gap between the knowledge and skills of the staff. What are you doing? Identifying your staff abilities, your staff skills, okay? You uh, see? I said skill. Number four, decide a skill and knowledge gap. Number? Four? Yep. Number three, evaluate performance after training. Mm. Oh, come on, Janita. You don't let Amber participate. <laughs> Amber is going to get mad. You know, she's here in the group. Hello, Amber. Hello. Still analyzing? 
Mm. Maybe. I hear you down. La escucho como, oh, tired today. Yes, I'm really tired. Maybe the side skill and knowledge gaps. No? Yeah, that's or number no. four. Um, but I don't know. Amber, by the way, tomorrow you got a chance to stay with me after the class? Tomorrow? <laughs> yeah. Whatever. <laughs> no problem for you? Okay. Oh, by the way, guys, este, enviamos todos el, los documentos. I don't know, teacher. I don't know. Resources. Oh, the company. Uh -huh. yeah. oh, by the way, Ambar, I wanted to congratulate you. Why? Because <laughs> you finished the platform. And I'm sorry, I don't usually say this, but estamos aquí en un grupito confianza. Okay, that cannot be recorded. <laughs> okay, guys, let me, yeah, I'm sorry, but that, that cannot be, I get in trouble. I'm not supposed to tell you. <laughs> okay, let me go check another group. I think everybody. Okay, let's see, number two is okay. Number five, hmm, okay, guys. Number five is not that one. Oh, okay. Oh, number four, it's that one, right? Yes, that's okay. number four. Number five, it's identify personnel, score, and skill, and knowledge. Mm -hmm. Analyze. Oh. Analyze the job. Yes, exactly. Yeah. For me, number mm. number one is the size, skill, and knowledge gap. The number mm. one, man. Yeah. So sorry. Number one and number two, Fernando, they start with identify. Ah, correct. Uh, yes, uh, correct. Identify person <laughs> skills. Yes, okay. that's the and correct number one. two. Identify training solutions. Uh, number two. Okay, <laughs> you're good. Right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that is our and that. We have you were that was the one that you were like trying to decide. Yeah. Mm. Number three, which is number three, Fernando? Evaluate performance after training. Perfect. Number four, Jensi. Is die skill and knowledge gap. Great. Gosh, guys, you are fast. Can I go with Let me go check another group. Yeah. yeah. And the last one to channel analyze the job. Yeah, sure. Okay. What the employees does well. And what needs improve improve improvement. Do you want a tip? Yes. Number one and number two, they start with identify. Yes, I know. I get it. We get it. Yeah. Okay, number three. We're looking for that. <laughs> Perfect. Evaluate. 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 Okay. Evaluate. Veamos. El otro es de, 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 
Oh, perfect, yep. Susana. Wow. Yeah. How is it going, Wilfredo? Yes, we finished, teacher. You finished? Yes. Okay, number one. Number one, decide the skills oh. and knowledge. Look, number one and number two, they both start with identify. Really? Identify personal current skills and knowledge. Perfect. Yes. Okay. Yes. Number two, number number two. Identify. Yes. Identify training, training solutions. solutions. Yes. Yes. Number three. Evaluate perform right. training. And the number four. I decide you because we, yes. we, we changed um, it. Okay. Ah yes, uh, yes, teacher. Okay, I, I perfect. Because yes. And the, well done, guys. the five analyze the job. Yes, let's go back to the Okay, guys, let's do this fast. Let's see, number one, list, list all opportunities and areas of the improvements where training is necessary to increase effectiveness. Decide if there is a gap between the knowledge and skills of the staff. I simply use what areas they need help with. Okay, help me out, Fernando, number one. Identify personal scoring, scoring skill and knowledge. Okay, excellent. Number two says, find the best way to provide training, one-on-one -on -one coaching, short-term and long-term trainings, e-learning, decide the option that best fits the needs of your staff and company. Uh, Wilfredo. I'm sorry, did you? number two. Yep. Identify training solution. Okay, identify training solutions. Perfect. Number three, ask staff members to use a checklist and evaluate their progress. Look at the work area and check if there is still evidence of a deficiency in skills or knowledge. Roxana. Please evaluate performance after training. Excellent. Number four, Observe what the employee does well and what needs improvement. Check for qualifications, training courses, and responsibilities from previous positions. Get more individual information from human resources. Mr. Osorio, number four. Decide skills and knowledge gap. Okay. Number five, discuss and describe the responsibilities of the position with the employee. Write down indicators of knowledge and skill that match the position. Identify the processes change in the description. That's number five, Carlos, please. Okay, teacher. Uh, analyze, analyze the job. Analyze the job. Analyze the job, okay? Analyze the job. 
Perfect. That's the correct pronunciation. Guys, it was well done. Uh, I'm sorry. I know that these exercises are like a lot of vocabulary and you got to read fast, but actually that's the way you have to do it. Okay. And remember, in these courses, you're going to get more into reading comprehension, listening comprehension. And the idea is that, that you read, analyze, and get the answer the fastest possible. That's why today I've been like with the time, like hitting it close. Okay. And oh my gosh, we are done. Oops. I have I had an extra activity, but we are going to do it tomorrow because time flew today. Perdón, me faltó una actividad, pero la cubriremos mañana. Se me fue el tiempo. Eh, Ambarelli Alfaro Gómez. Present. Thank you. Carlos Antonio Murillo Hernández. Present. Teacher. Claudia Lisset Ramos Barrientos. Present. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Present, teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present, teacher. Fras eh, José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present, teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present, teacher. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Present, teacher. Thank you, María Luisa. Welcome. I Marta and Avelinda. Intro de class. I got it. I got you. No problem. Marta and Avelinda Morales de Portillo. Present, teacher. Néstor Omar López Castro. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present. Thank you. Roxana Iveda Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present, teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present, teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present, teacher. Yanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present, teacher. Marcela Margarita Fuentes Nuila. Jensi Elizabeth Miranda de Odanes. Present. Thank you. Fabiola Georgina Silva. Present. Thank you. Hey, guys, before we leave, please, uh, for tomorrow, I need you to please check out uh, the exercise number seven, page number 35, okay? You need to check the, the process in the previous page to determine your skills and knowledge at work. Decide if you need to go to training and what training solutions would you prefer? Please, exercise seven, page number 35. I need you to bring it to the class because that way we can go straight to the conversation part, okay? If you bring that done already, the exercise is going to go faster. Besides that, uh, I will switch into Spanish just for a second. Recordarles a todos, eh, van a recibir el correo, no sé si ya lo recibieron algunos, para la encuesta final. Recuerden, esa la hacemos juntos. Eh, otra cosita, el trabajo en la plataforma. Tengo a estas alturas solamente dos personas que me la han terminado. Por favor, apresurémonos. Recordemos que el último día nos toca estar corriendo y no es necesario, ¿ok? Cualquier duda estoy a sus órdenes. Thank you very much. Appreciate having you here in the class. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, teacher. See you tomorrow, teacher. Have a good night. Have a good night. Bye. Bye. Have a good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. Bye, Amber. Bye, William. Bye, bye, Wilfredo. Bye, teacher. <laughs> Say what? Hi. Hello, Maria Alejandra. <laughs> How are you? I'm fine. And you? I'm just fine. Just fine. Okay, Maria Alejandra, let's see. I need you to work in something. Necesito que me trabaje en algo. 
Okay, uh, let's see. You are okay with vocabulary. Usted anda bien con vocabulario. You understand a lot of words. But I need you to improve a little bit in vocabulary. And let's go back again. El otro día creo que ya le mostré a usted lo de la plataforma, ¿verdad? Okay. But I don't need you just to get into the... Oops, hold on. Made a mistake. This is what I want to show you. Okay, here it is. Uh, remember, you go to Centro de Ayuda, you come all the way down to Recursos Académicos. I need you to come here and get into basic grammar and I need you to get into this. Look, uh, let's see. The grammar. simple past Yes, in grammar, I need you to work. Simple past, present progressive. Past in grammar and simple past, number eight, number six, number four. Yes, okay. And from the first part, the la primera parte, Adjective modifiers. This one, I need you to check it out. Este es el primero que necesitaría que revise. And check it out on your time and let me know if you got any question, okay? This is going to help you a lot. Because in your case, uh, what I notice is this. You understand, I mean, when I'm, whenever I'm speaking with you, you understand everything. But when you are trying to talk to me, your problem is that sometimes uh, it's like you got your idea, but you hesitate. Usted me duda. Uh -huh. How to <laughs> express the idea. And cómo expresar la idea. Yes. Right? Because you got the idea. Usted tiene la idea. Tiene el vocabulario. Porque sí me dicen las palabras correctas. <laughs> Pero no en el orden correcto. <laughs> Pero se me desordena y a veces se me salta a otro tiempo verbal. ¿Ok? Yes, I confuse the time. The Entonces, time. yeah, and I mean, the verb tenses is something simple and complex at the same time. And something that I need you to remember is this. Algo que necesito que recuerde eso. Mm -hmm. Tiempo presente simple. Se lo diré en español. Si ¿Sí tiene donde anotar. Sí. Presente simple. Expresa. Hábitos. Hechos o verdades. Y rutinas. ¿Qué quiere decir eso? Que en presente simple. Los adverbios de frecuencia son. Mandatory. Ahí van, ¿verdad? Esos son parte de, son parte integral del presente simple. ¿Por qué? Porque hábitos, rutinas, eso es frecuencia. Cuando decimos hechos o verdades, como hoy es de noche, hace calor, tengo un dolor de cabeza, ¿ya? Ahora bien, el pasado simple, simple past. Simple past expresses something that is already finished, done. Pasado simple expresa algo que ya terminó. Okay. Uh -huh. Es algo finito. Ya acabó. I mean, I studied English for many years. Yo estudié inglés muchos años. Ya, yeah, estudiarlo. Not, not really. Actually, we need to study all the time, but as an example. Ok, es algo que ya terminó. Present continuous. Presente continuo expresa. Si usted se recuerda, eso lo vimos en clase. Algo que está sucediendo en el momento. O una acción que está sucediendo durante un periodo de tiempo, pero que va a terminar pronto. Como por ejemplo, I am teaching 
a intermediate one, right? Estoy dando clases de intermedio uno. Oh, it's going to finish soon. Lo estoy dando en ese momento, sí, pero también lo estaré dando mañana, pasado, ¿ok? Si, por ejemplo, mañana por la mañana alguien me pregunta, ¿qué curso está dando? Oh, estoy dando intermedio uno. En ese momento no lo estoy dando, pero en el periodo de tiempo, sí. ¿Ok? Y los tiempos, luego vienen los perfectos, y los perfectos usted sabe de que el presente perfecto es una acción que comenzó en el pasado y continúa. No sabemos cuándo termina. ¿Ok? ¿Estamos bien con esas ideas hasta ahí? Yeah. I try to study three, these three topics and I, and I try to read and make a exercise and I have a doubt or I don't know. Doubt. 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 I ask you, I send a message or I don't know, but when I have time. What you will find are exercises, specific exercises, many exercises of the specific topic. Okay, mm -hmm. you get. It's going to help you a lot. And I need you to practice that. Why? Because that way, I mean, you are going to be the most you practice, the easier is going for you to become to give answers. I mean, they they are going to become reflex. La idea es que las respuestas se vuelvan reflejos en usted. Ya tiene mucho vocabulario. Usted me maneja bastante vocabulario, pero la siento indecisa a la hora de expresarse. ¿Qué necesitamos para eso? Práctica. ¿Ok? práctica. Eh, lo que le he dado, la información que le he dado ahora, le puede ayudar muchísimo para que este, me mejore en ello. Es una recomendación que le doy en base a... La idea es esta. Eh, no es que venga mal. No es que sea de las que más le cuesta para nada. Simplemente es un pequeño aspecto en el cual siento que puede mejorar. Okay. Creo de que en, en su caso, a pesar de sus obligaciones y todo, pues usted tiene más oportunidad como de investigar más y practicar más. You are not married. You ain't got no kids. Usted no tiene no. Está casada. So, I mean, you can do it. It's easier for you. So, let's try to do it. Hagamos el esfuerzo. Is that okay for you? Yes. Okay, teacher. Perfect. If anything... Oh, yeah. Cualquier cosa me avisa, ¿ok? Ahí se me avisa. All right. Yeah, you can text me. You can text me, no problem. Thank you very much, María Alejandra. Finish the platform, please. <laughs> yes, teacher. Right now, I try to work in the platform. <laughs> Perfect, excellent. Have a good night. Bye-bye. Thank you, teacher. Bye.